way you move it. Yeah. You got me yeah. in a trance. Yeah. DJ, yeah. tell me, yeah. yeah. Ladies, this show jam. Yeah. I'm a super scout. What's up you guys and welcome to Wine Jets. Just enjoy the stuff. My name is Max, aka Max Merlot, and we're here with Connor Courtney. Connor, nice to have you on the show. It's nice to be with you. Um, an old friend from high school, class of 2009. Yes. In the 2009. All right. Oh, almost spilled it. And uh, today we are sipping on some cupcake vineyards Moscato from the Piedmont or Piedmonte region in Italy. I got something light. Delicious and good tasting um, for Connor and I to sip today, so I want really good. Delicious and good tasting. <laughs> Delicious and good tasting. You like that one, don't you? And we also have Colby and Monterey Jack cheese from Walmart. <laughs> the cheese wine pairing. Exactly. The, the perfect cheese and wine pairing. <laughs> Did you go and buy that and bring it from your fridge? No, I bought it from Walmart. <laughs> You're right. Yeah. Walmart. There's not even a Walmart name for it. That tells you how special it was. All right, well, cool. A little out here? I'll go for it. Okay. Table's clean, I promise. First, let's do the sniffer. Tell me what you smell. All right. Smell a little wine. My wine? Yeah. Bring back any little memories or anything? Hmm. Yeah. I'm getting like this lemon. Oh, Jerry, go, go for it, Jerry. Yeah. Uh, a little bit of a little bit of lemon, like this. I always bring back the Sprite remix from like uh, like middle school. Surprising like middle school savers. Shout out to all the savers. Um, Sprite remix is what comes to my mind when I drink a lot of uh, Moscato from Piedmont. Um, Piedmont. And uh, yeah, that's why I smell a little tropical fruit, a little lemon, a little minerals. Let's see what's going on on the palate. Try for a section, power, wisdom, and courage. And um, on the palate, I'm getting this nice honey character, nice minerality, the tropical fruit. It's like eating, the, I think it's the blue tropical starburst, is what I get in this wine. 2010, so it's young, it was recently bottled, and it's only 5.5 five alcohol. So this is a treat. And if you want to drink the whole bottle, go for it, because it'll probably feel like drinking half a bottle otherwise. So you're telling me they put blue starburst in here? <laughs> they didn't. They. <laughs> you never know, because the label is cupcake. Mm -hmm. I wish, but I don't think they did. I was gonna say something about the aroma. What do you smell? I smell like a like a breeze from the north, so <laughs> from wheat fields maybe. Like like cold air from Canada. Probably the Appalachians, because you know <laughs> it's bottled in uh, Italy. You look at this cheese wine pair. Yeah. In chapter four, I uh, speak. This is this is the best in my experience. Out of what your book you have? Out of my book, yes. This is called "Want a Wine? Get Some Cheese." <laughs> <laughs> and you wrote it and published it. You got it's not published. It's this is my first, you know, debut of it. <laughs> okay. Exactly. Well, a good place to start. Yes. And you have more facts for us here today? Well, I have a little fact, I guess. Um, you know, it's actually the uh, introduction. <laughs> and, uh... <laughs> um, lay him lay on, man. Well, I don't know if you know this. Wine tasting is a sensory examination and the evolution of wine. While the practice of wine tasting is as ancient as its production, a more formal method has slowly become established since the 14th century. True fact. Yeah, riveting. <laughs> Absolutely riveting. Sorry. Yes. And that was the, the kind of the, Did you get it all? Um, for, for first chapter? Is that part of the first chapter? It's an introduction. <laughs> to wine tasting. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I thought a thorough definition. And you have here the best pairing for Moscato is Colby and Monterey. Yes. Jack cheese. As opposed to a Merlot would be a pepper jack. <laughs> what about a Cabernet Sauvignon? Um. That's pretty good. Yeah, that'd be just sharp cheddar. Yeah? Mm-hmm. Yeah. So you, you like wine? I love it. Yeah. Mm-hmm. You want that bottle? Yeah, if you want. Yeah? Yeah. 
So, what we got going on here, um, everything about it is tropical, light, fizzy, frizzy, uh, delicious, um, yeah, sweet wine, and at 10 bucks a bottle, if you're looking for something sweet, if you're on a first date, um, or, you want, a second. or a second, I'd, I'd recommend second. Okay. And if you want to have a good time, this is a nice wine to drink, um, and it's an easy starter. If you're like, oh, I want to drink my tongue lemonade tonight, but you kind of want wine, go with wine, get this, and you'll enjoy it. I got this at Happy's Market for 10 bones, and uh, yeah. I also have to note, because like the aftertaste is real, it's like almost better than the original, if you will. Of course. Like, once you swallow it, you still enjoy the flavor of the drink? That's yeah. Awesome. Like there's still bubbles yeah. on the tongue, yeah. the palate, if you will. Okay. You might. No. I think you're right. It's a good wine. And, um, so today's question is, this is Moscato. What was the last rap song you heard that used the word Moscato? No hands. Girl, where you moving? Got me in a chair. She's fast. DJ, turn me up. Ladies, it's your jam. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> Come on. I'm a Moscato. It's the background. <laughs> oh, Come on. on. It's Roscoe. Winejets.com. Just enjoy the stuff. Oh, sorry. It's okay. Yeah. Oh. But thank you. And thank you. For watching. For watching, yeah. Ha, ha, ha.